Hey everyone! I really like the look of wrapped bracelets, especially leather ones. I wanted to try out making some of my own, and when thinking of what material to use, I thought leather belts would be a perfect thing to recycle for making a bunch of different wrapped bracelets. You can make two to three bracelets from just one belt. You might have some old belts in your closet to recycle, or you can find a belt like this on a clearance rack for only a dollar. Maybe it didn't sell very well as a belt, but I think it makes one cool wrapped bracelet. To get started, I'm going to estimate how long the bracelet will be by wrapping the belt around my wrist. I'm wrapping this three times, and I tend to like my bracelets a little loose, so I'm leaving a little room for that as well. Then trim the ends, and you can save the other piece for another bracelet. The cut and style of your bracelet is totally up to your preference here. For thickness, again, it's totally up to you. I want mine to be thinner, so I'm trimming it to about a fourth of an inch with a roller and utility blade. And I can even use the leftovers from that for another bracelet. For the closures, I'm using these sew on snaps, which you can find at a fabric store, but you don't have to use the same. You can even just keep the belt buckle on and make a new hole at the length you want. The type of closure is up to you, so just choose the one that fits your style. Before sewing the snaps on, I'm going to make sure I know which end goes where. Then mark. And pre-punch the sewing holes with a tack to make the sewing part easier. This material is thick, and a needle alone will be hard to push through without doing this. Do this to both ends. Now using a sewing needle and thread, sew on the snaps, just like you would sew on a button. I double threaded this needle just to make the thread stronger. When you feel like the snap is pretty secure, tie the thread off in a knot and cut it off. Do this to both ends. Now you can sport your new wrapped bracelet. Repeat this same method with other belts to make even more bracelets. For this one, I decided to wrap it just twice. I really like the middle section of this belt, so I trimmed around that to make another bracelet. Remember that piece I kept from the first belt? Well, I sewed some black embroidery thread through the holes, added some snaps, and bam, a new bracelet. You can really customize these however you want to suit your own style. If you like this tutorial, click that like button, and let me know what you think in the comments below. I'd love to see pics of the bracelets you make, so please post those on my social links listed here, and follow me for more Sea Lemon updates. If you're ready for another tutorial, you might also like one of these here. You can find direct links to these videos and more listed in the description.